I'm standing at the top of Soldam with the Clue team, and we are about to ride the longest run maybe in the world, probably in Europe. It is 9.2 miles long, 14 or 15 kilometers. You guys comment down below which one that is, and it's going to be massive and long, and we're literally going to go from no visibility, gnarly, to summer springtime riding at the bottom, I'm pretty sure. So enough talking. We have a very long run ahead of us. You guys ready? Ready, yeah. Let's do it. Now this is our second attempt at it. The first attempt, I took the wrong turn because it was a tunnel and I wa really wanted to go through the tunnel. When you get a chance to, to ride through a tunnel, you ride through the tunnel. I'm gonna do my best to talk to you guys. My microphone might die. We've been out here snowboarding all day. So if they do, I'll unplug them. Hopefully, I will have to check. But we gotta go right. We went into, it's hard not to go into that tunnel. Look at it. Well, now we go this way. <laughs> I really cannot see. But this aspect that we're on, this mountain, whatever, Definitely yeah, had the best snow today. It's crazy how every spot has different zones and snow. I get I get scared though. I've learned that there's no ropes, there's nothing that's close, and you can just ride up to a cliff. So I'm sticking with these uh, blue signs. I think eventually we'll be able to see. Stick with me, we're, we're, once again, we're going nine miles. I don't even know if my legs can handle riding nine miles. <laughs> we keep riding off the run. <laughs> now, I do know that this is more of a cat track than my microphone is still on. But you know this is more of a cat track than it is like a rad rad run. I think 32 is what we want to be riding. I've lost the the clue team. But visibility is getting better. Also, it's like the end of the day. So I'm assuming this cat track is going to have lots of people on it. views here though are insane these mountains are just so different than the United States I, I would say the resorts are even more unique like where you're riding no trees
That was really nice. I believe we're still going the right way. I apologize for checking to see if my microphone is still going. But I want to be able to talk to you guys. My legs are already feeling it. <sighs> I believe we uh, go under this road. <laughs> I have no idea. Check in the uh, microphone. Here's another tunnel. This feels about right. It's like the longest fat track I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> I guess I can check my microphone by looking at it. <laughs> now it's in my hand. <laughs> ah! Yeah, so I'm out here with uh, Clue Bindings, by the way, guys. There's the, my binding sponsor. These guys are rad. They're a hybrid step-in system. Best bindings in the game, for sure. And they uh, brought me out to Europe. This is our first resort on our uh, little tour we're doing. We're doing St. Anton's, uh, Lox, and also uh, Montefon. Are all the resorts we're doing. I know Lox is in Switzerland, the other in Austria. And I'm having a blast. I'm uh, so stoked that the sun has peeked through <laughs> the beginning of the day was like, oh man, what is this going to be like? But uh, it has gotten so nice. I'm going to go switch for a second. <laughs> My legs are burning. Uh, but 
Now we're doing, I didn't even know this existed, a 9.2 mile long run. And when I saw that it did, I was like, oh, top to bottom run. We got to do this. Got to show people like uh, 3.5 miles is the longest run in North America. And that's nothing compared to this. However, these long runs tend to be pretty green, pretty mellow, normally cat tracks. But this thing's moving, we're, we're cruising. Uh, as you can tell, we had nice powdery snow up top. Now we're kind of getting like some firm icy, and I'm pretty sure we're gonna be riding slush. I might take my jacket off by the time we get to the bottom, because I might be so hot. And I don't know how many miles we've gone already. If I had to guess, three. I, I think we're one third of the way. So as long as this microphone stays warm, it won't shut off. We'll be able to talk to each other. Hopefully the Insta360 continues to uh, film this whole way. Is it nine miles? I'm thinking this is going to take about 20 minutes to finish this whole run. I could be wrong with that. You guys let me know if uh, in the comments. Sorry. Oh. Honestly, this run's less busy than when we first rolled up and saw it for the first time. I was like, oh, there's going to be so many people. Not bad, not that many people. <laughs> also, you gotta see if my arms can hold these this pole for the whole time. It's a, uh, the camera gets heavy. But I'm gonna give you guys a shot of the view from behind. It's, it is a gorgeous. Look at these mountains. Very, very steep out here. Oh, come on, keep the speed. I don't know if I'll ever run out of speed, but if I do, I'll be able to show off the clue bindings and how they work. I'm just now starting to get a little bit of like foot tingle. Ooh. Uh, that was the other thing. I was like, I don't know if my feet will be able to handle this whole run, but we're going to find out. So far, feeling good. Really, I'm going to be so thirsty after talking for however long this is. Because I don't want it to be boring for you guys. Well, we got this. No stopping. No walking. <laughs> this is super slick. <laughs> We're moving. hands by the way if you want to snag one of my evolution stickers and support my traveling that's the the best way to support me uh, even though clue did bring me on this trip so I want to get a shout out to them but if you want to grab an evolution sticker they're linked down below if you live in Austria or Germany or Switzerland or any country that's not in the United States my stickers ship free to you guys which uh, is super rad and a lot of you guys I've shipped stickers all over the world so shout out to you guys thank you so much and so I see. Uh, yeah, thanks for the, that support. We're still going. Don't worry. There's like some base area over here. Ah! Another tunnel. I wonder how many tunnels we're going through on this epic journey. It looks like we might be getting halfway-ish. See a new chairlift. Oh, we're in tree line now. Finally made it a tree line. So this is the first time I've seen trees today. Everything we've ridden has been above tree line. Oh. Hopefully I make the right turns. The resort's infrastructure is insane. Seven. Let me, uh, I gotta check this map real quick. I don't want to make the wrong turn. Thirty to six to seven. I think this is the one. 
Hopefully, because if I don't ride up, if I don't show up at the right spot, I haven't got a SIM card for my phone yet. It's going to be a, a trip meeting up with the, uh, the team. Oh, this snow is all sorts of weird, hard, chunky, chattery. Choke point right here, I don't want to watch out for other people. Moguls. <laughs> I think we're, we're getting closer and closer to the slush. I'm telling you, we are going to be riding out into potatoes from powder. There's no going back. This is the video. If I make the wrong turn, guys, just know you can ride to the bottom. Oh, look at that mountain. There's a, that's a ski resort, too. Oh, that guy just ate it. I don't know if seven. Legs are feeling good. I'm not gonna lie. We're feeling good. Now we're getting in the slush too, which is like so fun. I don't think I had to do seven B. I think seven B is like more beginner. I think that's what's going on. I gotta change my hands. My hands burn. It's the only thing that hurts right now. I wonder what the fastest someone's done this. This is definitely not the fastest run. But uh, write your speed in the comments how fast you've done this run. If you've done it. I've never like started a run and then needed to go to the bathroom because the run has been so long. Now I'm at the point where I, like, I would like to take my jacket off. It's so hot. <laughs> Dude, it's summer down here. This has got to be the closest to uh, teleporting you can do. Two different worlds. Watch out for people. I don't even think this is the bottom. I think this is like a pre-bottom. We gotta keep going lower. If you haven't hit the subscribe button yet, you gotta do that. We are doing this whole run. How do I get on this side? What is this thing? The T-bar fell apart? Uh, subscribe. If you haven't subscribed yet, like this video as well. This is uh a little bit of work, you know. Sorry to feel the leg burn in my back leg. If I, would, if I would have rode more switch, which I can, I just get nervous. All these, all these people. There's another tunnel. Who's, who's keeping count? Little Grom City. 
I think this is a shortcut. Does this count? The, the miles, if I take the shortcut? I think so, we, we can't take the shortcut. <sighs> no shortcuts, we're, we're in it, we're with these people. Maybe I should be more aggressive. Whenever I'm making videos, I tend to be more passive, but I don't want to be rude. Also, if you run into someone and you're making content, that does, that's, not, that's a bad look. Oh. Sorry. Oh, I think we did it. <laughs> I think we've made it to the bottom. Do something like this. This guy's kind of keeping me in this corner. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. This is the start. We did it. 9.3 miles. That was rad. We did that pretty quick. I don't know how long it was. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Microphone stay live the whole time, which is all I really cared about. But with that, T-Mock House, thank you so much for shredding with me today. And as always, shout out to Clue, hold on, for bringing me out here, making this possible. Watch this. Boom. And then I can just step back in, start ripping. You need bindings. They're in the description. Shout out to Clue. And as always, thanks for shredding with me. Thanks for watching. Keep evolving. We'll see you tomorrow in another video. Stay there on this channel. We do feel like this. Damn!